what you would pay a person say like that got a year or so okay that's that's not going to happen that's that's not going to happen but but for a person that does have like say like two or three years up under their belt coming in at at 30 38 cent a mile just ain't cutting it no more you know right. it it just don't cut it no more uh-huh. you know you you want you you want the guy you you want the guy to the to, to come there to drive for you not only give him good pay but give him an give him a good incentive to drive for your company you know maybe better trucks uh-huh. maybe better trucks maybe better communications between you and the you know him and the fleet manager um uh you know better work life you know work uh work and life balance uh when i want to go home i should be going home on the day that i want to go home and 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 any other you know and any other stuff that should be relevant to you to stay you know and right. you know, a lot of these companies just <sighs> Just, just, just don't see it that way. And it's unfortunate that you gotta, that you got a job hop from company to company to try to find that company. And it's, it's crazy. Exactly. I thought, I thought, mm-hmm. I thought U.S. Express was gonna be the end all, be all for me. But pff, who knew? Four companies later. <laughs> right. Uh, I thought about them too, but I changed my mind with that Target account. Mm-hmm. It wasn't paying enough. So what about so what about you? How long how how long have you how long have you been driving? Because it sounds like it, it sounds like you said you 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 was with Snyder. Did you get your license through Snyder or you got your license out? Uh, I, I mean, to a trucking school. Oh, you went to a trucking school to get your license. Okay, now let me uh, ask. Yeah. Now let me ask you this: Why did you choose? a trucking school over going to an actual uh, trucking company? Oh, I went to a trucking company. Swift was one of them. Mm-hmm. The trainers was like garbage. I wasn't I wasn't retaining whatever they were spitting out. Mm-hmm. They didn't know what they were doing. And so I decided to go to a trucking school. Oh, okay, okay. And that's why I got it. At. Okay, so you decided, so you so you did go to uh, Swift Academy. Which Which one? In Memphis, Tennessee. Memphis, Tennessee. Did they get you? Okay, so when you went there, you said you said the experience. (laughs) (laughs) You said the experience was garbage. Like, so what? What did what What did they do that you didn't like? They couldn't train. Oh my god! They could not train. They couldn't explain things. It was it was ridiculous. So how were other brothers there? So did you? So did you leave? Well, of course you left, and you didn't get your license. Did they? Was there any blowback from that? No, I didn't even take the test because I knew I wasn't ready. I didn't learn anything, so why am I take the test? I just left. Okay, okay, okay. That's what's up. All right. What about uh? All right. So, mm-hmm. you, so you actually went to truck. How long ago was this? In March of 2017, I I got my CDL. Oh, okay. Well, congratulations for. Well, thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> um. All right. So, so from there, you you just went on here, went to school. You you paid out of pocket for going to school or did you get a grant or how, how was your schooling paid for? Uh uh-uh, paid out of pocket. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Yeah, that sounded like me. I I did the credit card thing. You know, they was like, yo, you sure you wanna sure you wanna uh do this, uh Mr. Lockout? I said <laughs> say yeah, let's let's go ahead and do this before I change my mind. So cha ching and then, you know, psh- Got got it done. Got it done. All right. Uh all right. So Snyder. You so you did go through Snyder. You you did want to you had some inclinations of going back. What was your experience at Snyder? I worked for Snyder twice. 
That twice. Um, okay. Yes. So no uh, no no third time first? no third time's the charm, huh? <laughs> if they would have went up on the pay, I would have. Uh, okay. But they were okay. still trying to pay the same thing. Okay. Okay. So the first time. So the first time. Uh, the first time was. Um, the first time I stayed for like six months. That was in 2018. Mm-hmm. Um. Wait, that wasn't 18. Yeah, because last year I worked for them too. So that was 2018. I left then to go local. Okay. And the last time, last year, I left because of the dispatcher and then the truck. It was some issues with the truck that I couldn't have an accident. And the dispatcher was not listening to what I was saying as if he's driving the truck and know what's going on. Okay. And so when the truck... It was several things going on with the truck. One issue was the brake, because the truck kept um, swerving to one side. Mm -hmm. And like, if I'm in the middle lane and cars on the, um, I'm in between cars, it's like I have to hold the steering wheel so tight to keep it from swerving on the car. Mm -hmm. And so they finally, I took the shop, took it to the shop like three times, and then somebody finally found out it was something wrong with the brake. Okay. So then I. This is where I just decided to quit. Well, I'm driving like 3 o'clock in the morning. Mm. And you know how the truck would hit on brake? Mm -hmm. That thing hit on brake so hard, you hear the, the trailer tires making that uh, noise. That was it for me. Because if somebody was behind me, they would have ran right into me. You said that You said that was it. <laughs> you said that was it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, that yeah. Uh it sounds it sounds as though that they didn't that that they didn't keep their equipment tight. Is is that fair to say? Right. Yeah, with that particular truck, yeah. You know, I, I, I talked to several different drivers that drove for Snyder. I mean, Snyder is uh is a quote unquote good company, but some of their equipment is garbage. Right. I mean, I just yeah. I, I just recently talked to a uh, uh, driver, Melissa. Uh, she said when she came in, she had to put her truck in the shop like a whole bunch. Of, well, not a whole bunch of times. I probably might be exaggerating that, but uh, she said she put her truck in there at least twice. Um. Then I talked to another. Uh, I talked to another a former driver. And he said that he had to go and recover a truck, and the truck was like atrocious. Like he had to oh, put, a, he said he had to put on a hazmat suit to drive that. Wait, was it coronavirus time? I'm not. I, I think this was like back in eighteen, nineteen, before pre, uh, pre corona. Yeah, pre. Okay. Let me see. Pre. Let me see. Pre Corona is nineteen. Uh, night. I mean nineteen. God damn it. Uh, 2019, 2018, and then pro. Uh, post Corona is is now. But, but yeah, pre Corona. Yeah, he said he had to put on a hazmat suit to drive that motherfucker. I was hey, like, uh -huh. I was like, bro. <laughs> I said, are you serious? He was like, yeah, bro. I had to put on a hazmat suit. So he said Snyder. He said Snyder is not a bad company per se, but he said their equipment is garbage. Well, the first time I had it, I didn't have any problems. It was the second truck. Oh, okay. The well, second time working with them. You, I, I was yeah. about to say, so it's not the second truck while you was there the first time, but the second truck while you was there the second time. Right. Oh, okay. All right. So, so you you gave them another shot. Why Why did you leave a second time? The dispatcher. God damn it. <laughs> oh yeah, it was a dispatcher. It was the same dispatcher I had the first time, and I didn't want him the first time. I switched the counts to get away from him then, and I went back and got him again. <laughs> <laughs> did you try to did did you try to talk talk to somebody to switch dispatchers or if or you just say yeah. you just say bump it I'm uh, out. I talked to the manager and what, what I talked to the manager. What did he say? But you know how a lot of these people. It was a female. They like to uphold these dispatchers. 
by any means necessary. <laughs> so, um, I asked her, can I change? Mm-hmm. And she was saying that he he actually doing his job. Like, he tried to control how I drive. I like driving at night. Mm-hmm. DOT saying that that's the, the time that most accidents are happening. Right. You can't put that on everybody. Right. Some people like driving at night. Some people can't. And so we want to try to keep me on days. Anytime it'll make the road will go where I work it, I mean I drive at night, he'll have a set where I have to shut down oh um, well I just start in the next morning. Uh, That's not okay. how I like drive. I have to drive how I'm comfortable driving. Well you you're you know they you know, all of us out here say the same thing. Hold on for a second. Hold hold on. Okay. You know, all of us say the same thing out here that's that we like, oh, well, we're the captain of our ship. That's not always the case. <laughs> right. Man, we're we're, right. We're, we're, we're we're the captain of the ship, but you know, we 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 gotta we we gotta we gotta mo- we gotta mo- motor boat through waters of somebody else's sea. <laughs> so right. and you know how um they say statistics says that drivers Rick, normally at night, those midnight hours after those hours, mm-hmm. those probably drivers who don't like driving at night, y'all force them to drive at night. Exactly. Ooh, all right, all right. Look, this is a this is an awesome conversation. Didn't expect it to last this long. But, um. All right. No. So, uh, thank you for your awesome, awesome, awesome support, man. I really do appreciate it. When did, welcome. when did you hook up with me? Like when when did you when when did you hook up? When did you find me? Um actually I think you found me because you popped up on my YouTube <laughs> <laughs> where I be scrolling through. You just came out of nowhere. <laughs> That's what I like. And so to do. I just clicked on it and listened to it. That's what I like to do. I like to sneak up on people. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> who who are you? Blackout, man. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, but I, I think y'all pop up like if I listen to you know another YouTuber mm-hmm. from live. I guess other ones pop up. Now, hey, let me ask so you. Maybe that's how yours pop up. I don't let, know. Let, mm-hmm. let me ask you this right quick because, like I said, I I shouted you, I, I shout you out all the time because you 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 always you always a mainstay uh with me and I do appreciate it. Uh, but let me ask you this though. Let me ask you this. If I move from YouTube over to TikTok, would you follow me? See, I don't, YouTube is the only thing I be. I don't even have your TikTok, but I'll get out create one. Well, okay, yeah, because uh I'm I'm doing extremely well over there. Didn't realize you know what? Okay. I was I I was not a fan of TikTok. I really wasn't. Uh, you know, I always thought TikTok was like for these kids and these challenges and all this other bullshit. But it's right. a, it's a lot of truckers over there, man. Like it, it's a lot of it, it's a lot of trucking, co- even though it's short. But it's right. a lot of trucking content over there, man. And I'm over here like, okay, I'm about to I'm about to jump in on this. I'm already. I'm all man. Let me tell you something. Between last night, let me see. Last night, I'll say what today? Wednesday. Today's Wednesday, right? So I say between yep. I say between Monday to Wednesday. I I'm I'm already at a well. I'm all well. I got like it, it's like I get like ten subscribers or ten followers, ten fifteen followers a day. That's 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 okay. kind of that's kind of crazy growth over there, you know, versus on YouTube. It's like maybe one here, one there. I'm over here like, look, I, and I already told YouTube, I'm like, yo, as soon as TikTok go to long form, I'm 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 there. <laughs> right. But uh But I see your little small clips on TikTok. Mm-hmm. So I watch those, but I guess I have to open up my camera or something. Uh, what the 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 follow? I I think you probably yeah I think you probably do have to do like a little account to follow somebody. But yeah, 
But I, oh, I again, man, I do appreciate you. So thank you very much. Uh, you are welcome. So you're uh, so you you've been driving since seventeen. So do you? Do you? Have no, a, I've been driving off and on since seventeen. Oh, off and on since seventeen. Okay. So yeah. What what made you what what made you get in what made you get into it? Because I like driving and oh. I'm always driving in my car, so I might as well get paid for it. Oh, okay, okay. So you have any you you got kids or anything like that? You married? What's what's the deal? What's oh, your background? I'm not married, but I have three three daughters. Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right, three daughters. Why mm-hmm. why why you not married? What's 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 going on with that? I have been married. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. I have a I have a boyfriend. Um, but I'm kind of like trying to get my life right with God. So oh, okay. I I don't I don't do nothing that I'm supposed to be doing in God's eye, and I stopped that October of last year. Oh Lord, I'm bu- okay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. Uh, how, how how's your boyfriend <laughs> taking that? Issue, but yeah. when you're a good woman, yeah. that's what men do. They stick with you, and he don't bother me about you know that or whatever. Uh-huh. I don't know if he's probably messing around, but uh-huh. as long as I ain't got to do it, I don't care. Well, wait a minute, wait, wait, hold on. We we got a Kevin Samuels moment here. I was just about to hang up. On, I mean, hang up with you, and you you just you you just turned this into a Kevin Samuels moment right here, man. <laughs> Uh uh-uh, uh, come on now! You you say the way, wait, wait! You 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 stop doing what you're doing because you want to get right with God. That's no problem. I'm not I'm not giving you no qualms about that. But your your boyfriend may or may not have an issue. He's still sticking it out with you and all like that. But you saying or are are you saying that you don't care if he? You know, try to, you know, satisfy his sexual appetite. Mm-mm. Now, he don't know that I don't care, but I don't. I don't care because I don't look at things how y'all look at things. I look at things in a different aspect. Okay. Um. Because I know me and have me. Right. And so whether he, you know, doing something or not, I don't know. He didn't want me to stay there with him. That that was his choice. He didn't want me there. Okay. Well, I, well hey, if that, that's a good, if that's the case, that's a good that that's a good dude. Why deny him? Him? Why why deny him if he's if he's you know sticking it out with you? I just told you why. No. I decided to change my life around to do what I need to do because doing that is not going to get me in heaven. Okay. And if he know the walk that I'm walking and he chooses to still want me to be there, that's on him. Oh, okay. That's hey, that's what's up. That's I- his choice. So whatever can you say, um, say, you say that ain't for everybody. Right. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> And another thing, I guess something wrong with those women or whatever, but I know I'm good over here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Another thing about Kevin saying is that I I don't why well, I don't care for him because he's trying to tell these women mm-hmm. why they can't find a man, why they can't keep a man. And God's I they don't supposed to be looking for a man, the men supposed to find them. So they stupid to even listen to anything he even gotta say, but he don't even leave them down the right the right path. <laughs> hey, look! He's look. not even a kill man himself. <laughs> He's gonna kill him. <laughs> what women have he killed? Well, look, I, you know, like I said, I, I, I just watch him for entertainment value. I mean, you know, he's, he's, I he's. I spend my time on some valuable, and that's unvaluable to me. Yeah, he, he's the uh, flavor of the. He's a flavor of the month right now, man. So I don't know why, because that's why the worldly people saying that nonsense. They need to be listening to Tony Evans. Oh, okay, okay. Charles Stanley. All right. People who've been married who can get him some some valid advice. Not somebody who's never been married. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. Well, all right, man. Well, hey, again, thank you for the support, man. All the way around, number one. 
uh number one fan of the channel so thank you very much and i'm i'm hoping i'm hoping that i will keep giving you uh keep giving you the good uh good content that you know that i'm known to give you so i appreciate you yeah well, i appreciate you all right <laughs> All right, driver. So if you need anything else, or you know, need anything else, you know how to get in contact with me. You got the number, so reach out to me anytime, and uh, and, we'll, right. and we'll definitely go from there, man. And much success, All right. much much success to you, and and definitely much success in your travels. Um, you know that okay, that you're going you. that you're going forward into, you know, going forward and heading into the pearly gates. I don't know if that's going to work yes, out for sir. me. <laughs> <laughs> <You're> but, <laughs> yeah, I don't know if that's going to work out for me, but yeah, that 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 won't be no problem though. But I support you no matter yeah. what. All right. All right, I'll holler at you. Make sure you get home safe, all right? All right. All right, I'll holler all at right. you later. Okay. Bye.